Welcome to another Quiet PC video with myself, Andy Ford. Now today we're going to do something totally different and just for fun. So have you ever wondered if it's possible to cool an i7 7700K with 15 pounds worth of 20 pence coins? That's 75 coins. Probably not, but I did. So let's just take a look and see what happens. Let's see if we can build a fanless CPU cooler out of 20 pence coins. There's only one place to be for a new PC. QuietPC.com So before we start, let's just take a quick look at the equipment we're going to be using. The motherboard itself is actually on the Streetcom STBC1 open bench table. And if you do a lot of testing and are constantly moving components in and out of a computer case, then this bench could be exactly what you're looking for. It's something we do actually sell, so I'll, I'll, I'll show you the links to that in the video description below. Also, we've got the Noctua NTH1 thermal paste, which we're going to use to actually help bond the coins together. Right, the only thing left to do now is to actually start building the cooler out of 20 pence coins, and then we can put it on test and see what we get. Well, that took a little bit longer than expected to build, but I have to say, worth the effort. Right then, let's just switch on and see what we can make of this 15 pounds cooler comprised of 20 pence pieces. Let's see what temperatures we do actually get using this cooler. So I've had the PC switched on now for around an hour and all the temperatures have settled down and it's doing absolutely nothing. So currently the temperature is 54 or 55 degrees and it's, it's fluctuating slightly either way. So what we're going to do now is put it under, under some slight load using Passmark's burning test software. And I'm going to put all the tests on at 50% and see what happens. Personally, I suspect that it's probably going to get quite hot quite quickly, probably within 30 seconds or so, but we'll see. We'll try it at 50% first, and then if that doesn't max it out, I'll put it to 100%. So let's start the test. Well, I've just started recording and the temperature is currently at 50 degrees. So let me just set the burning test going and we can uh, see what happens. So we're at 30 seconds in and currently the temperature is hovering around 70, 75 degrees. So here we are one minute in and it's now around, varying between about 88 and 9800 degrees. Just over two minutes in and the temperature is fluctuating between about 95 and 100 degrees. So we're just on the five minute mark and I think that's probably about it. The, the temperature's around 98 to 100 degrees constantly. CPU load is around 22, 26%. So I think that's basically the test over and done with. So to answer the question, can 75 20 pence pieces or 15 pounds actually cool a 91 watt i7 7700K processor? It can, just as long as you're not doing very much. And obviously this is a little bit impractical. So my advice would be to save your pennies or your 20 pence pieces and buy a proper cooler instead. Thanks for watching, stay tuned and I'll see you in the next video.